All right, Shalom, Shalom. First things first, I want to give all honor and praise unto Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rakhar Kadash, the Rock of the Yahweh, Brock of the Yahweh Shai, the Rock of the Yahweh, Brock of the Yahweh Shai, the Rock of the Yahweh, Brock of the Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rakhar Kadash. And we give double honors to our apostles and elders, which are the apostles and elders, a great millstone, and to you, hopeful elect on the four corners of the planet Earth that's pushing, fighting, maintaining. We're in the time of the end. 2020 is a, a hell of a year. The year of prophecy is doing its thing once again. Um, we're going to jump right into this uh, lesson, as you see right here, and into you hopeful elect and confusion of faith that's coming in these last days. We're in beautiful positions, man. All right, so we just got to keep faith and keep fighting. Um, we just had an explosion in Beirut, the port. I'm sure you brothers have heard. Uh, if not, you know, the Beirut explosion did take place. But the, the thing about the Beirut explosion, when I was watching it, I was watching it on uh, live, and uh, a certain scene caught my eye was the way that the explosion took place because these ex explosions like this happen so often um every every few years you know if you've been doing news a little bit and news stories you you you've noticed that explosions like this take place and i always see these explosions to take it as a sign to say we get closer and closer this one is in a heavy beirut is a populated city okay very dense and for this type of explosion you even had that explosion that happened in china you had the one that happened in the Middle East, all right? You had different explosions of, 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 of mass magnitude, okay? But this one right here, the certain camera angles that was caught was was a very, you know, ominous thing to show. It was a sign I, I seen in the spirit that things are coming, man, all right? The things like this, we're going to witness a nuclear disaster in our lifetimes, man, you know, because we know that the, the destruction is coming to Babylon the Great. And we're going to see things happen way uh, prior to that, man. We got all types of things and, that are set. The stage is set. Uh, Trump is trying to ban TikTok. You know, but those are news updates. So let's play this video. I'm not going to uh, uh, make it big, but I'll play it small and then I'll pause it and we'll get into uh, get into some precepts. Hmm. Right there. Can you see that? Boom. So now, this is the book of Revelations. This is Revelation 6 and 12. And it says, And I beheld when he had opened the sixth seal, and lo, there was a great earthquake, and the sun became black as sackcloth of hair, and the moon became as blood, and the stars of heaven fell unto the earth, even as figs, even as a fig tree cast her untimely figs. When she is shaken of a mighty wind. See? If you see this. Precepts just came to my mind. Because you see the explosion and how it came. It was a wind. After the explosion, what, what went off? You can hear it. You can hear it. You can hit it, hear it before it even hit them. So imagine in that time when the Lord allows these things to take place in the city, it's going to be likened unto this and worse, man. We, but that wind that's coming off the, these nuclear weapons are going to be a destroying wind because they're going to be uh, burning uh, multi, multiple times hotter than the sun. All right. So it's going to be it's going to scorch earth. So let's read that again. That's why you have to tie uh, things in with the Bible. Visuals are such a powerful tool, man. That shows you the Bible was what was John seeing? John was seeing something like this. The Lord put him in a position to be able to see it. What? A destroying wind. This is what he could describe it at. And, and look what we see today. The blast from these bombs look like wind. Boom. So John in that time could only describe it with what he had to describe it as. It says, and as the stars of heaven fell unto the earth, even as a fig cast her untimely figs, when she is shaken of a mighty wind, and the heaven departed as a scroll when it is rolled together, and even and every mountain and isle were moved out of their places. See? And you see, this is going to be a big explosion on the planet earth because different uh, nations are going to be launching these weapons on each other, man. All right? And you're going to see a, a great destruction take place. All right, let's go back into the video.
And this wasn't, this, look at the devastation it caused. And these weren't even nuclear weapons. They might have had material in there, but it wasn't the, the full thing, man. It's the book of Isaiah 34 and verse 4. It says that all the hosts of heaven shall be dissolved and the heavens shall be rolled together as a scroll and all the hosts shall fall down. Now look at this video. Look what happens to the heavens right above the explosion. Look what happens to the mushroom cloud. Look at look at the it pushed the clouds away to the background, man. All right. Roll together as a scroll. See? Roll together as a scroll. So John, when he was, um, so like Isaiah, when he was describing it, he only had to use the terminology. That's why multiple times you see scroll. You see wind. You see these different words being used to describe this because they were back in, they're, they're, because some of them are back today and uh, and some will witness that. You know, but the ones that was being seen, they were being shown a vision and they only they couldn't describe. Oh, uh, it's even an explosion. You had certain things that blew up, but not like this. What? 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 This is Isaiah. This is Isaiah. 13. Yep. Therefore, I will shake the heavens and the earth shall remove out of her place in the wrath of the Lord of hosts in the day of his fierce anger. So these things, when this when this thing take place on the earth, it's going to be far worse than this because this is just one and it's an accident. All right. But I just seen this video and I thought to share with brothers and go in and to say, hey, this was a, sh a foreshadowing, man. All right. That's a good one. Oh. Look like you even had a little tiny face coming up. Watch. With a, with a big woolly. Look like you had a face almost in there. Look. I'm just seeing. I'm just. I just. They're like a fro with a big white beard. Oh. That's just a little funny. You made it look like it. But that's intense fire, man. You can even see the smoke is it's got some flames in it, man. See that wind? Whoa, you seen it, bump. It started coming. Now's that destroying wind. Look at it right here. It was somewhat like a not the destroying wind, but it was a wind that that's what blew things and blew windows out was that explosion. So with that, I want to give all honor and praise unto Yahweh, Bashem Yahushai, Bashem Akar Kadash, Barakat the Yahweh, Barakat the Yahushai, Barakat the Yahweh, Barakat the Yahushai, Barakat the Yahweh, Barakat the Yahushai, Bashem Akar Kadash. Till the next time, Shalom, Makim, keep faith, man. Beautiful things we're seeing and witnessing, man. The Lord's coming for his elect. Shalom.